Hello, and welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into some exciting news for international students looking to study in British Columbia. So, if you're considering pursuing your education in this beautiful province, you're in the right place. Now, let's talk about something important, Provincial Attestation Letters, or PALS. These are like golden tickets for international students applying for study permits in British Columbia. What are PALS? PALS are official letters that prove you've been accepted by a recognized learning institution in British Columbia. Think of it as your stamp of approval to study here. Why PALS matter? Now, you might wonder why PALS are such a big deal. Well, without one, it's like trying to enter a concert without a ticket you won't get in. These letters are crucial for your study permit application process. But here's the exciting part. British Columbia has just rolled out its PAL system starting March 4th, 2024. Let's delve deeper into the details. PAL Allocation and IRCC The government of British Columbia has been allocated 83,000 undergraduate study permit applications by Immigration, Refugees, and Citizenship Canada, or IRCC. This means there's a chance for around 50,000 approved study permits for this year. However, this is a decrease compared to last year. PAL Distribution Now, how are these PALs distributed? Well, approximately 53% go to public institutions and the remaining 47% to private ones. This change aims to manage the growth of international students in the province. But why the change? Let's uncover the bigger picture. IRCC Study Permit Cap IRCC recently announced a cap on study permits for 2024, limiting the number to 360,000, a 35% reduction from the previous year. This decision is influenced by concerns about the sustainability of Canada's international student program. Impact and Changes The cap isn't just affecting British Columbia, it's a nationwide change. Alongside the CAP, IRCC is also tweaking eligibility criteria for post-graduation work permits and spousal open work permits. British Columbia's Response British Columbia isn't sitting idly by. They're implementing measures to ensure quality education and support for international students. These include pausing approvals for new institutions and raising standards for private degree programs. And there you have it, the latest scoop on PALS and study permits in British Columbia. We hope this information helps you navigate your educational journey. Remember, the world is your oyster, and with the right preparation, you can achieve anything. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more updates on education and beyond. See you next time.